All the, everyone's afraid always when they fly of engine failures. That the plane just starts plummeting towards the earth or takes a nosedive with no propeller to move it through the air. And honestly, if you want to see what an engine out looks like, I can't actually shut off the engine. That's dangerous. What I will do is the exact same thing. It's just we cut off all the power using the throttle. So I'm going to pull it all the way out. This was what would happen. So we're pitching up to our best glide rate, which would be 69 knots, 70 knots. There we go. We become a giant glider. And the propeller is spinning because the wind is, is windmilling it. But all we're doing is ascending 500 feet per minute, and we can even do less if we pitch up more and keep our speed in the green arc. And all this is doing is just simulating an engine failure, and we find a place traffic. to land. Uh, okay, it's really not as dangerous as people would think. 3,000 feet maneuvering, descending down to pattern altitude for 170, Decatur.